Making seasons bright at Charlotte Motor Speedway. Speedway Christmas kicks off in Concord tonight and families can take a turn around the track to take in the biggest drive through holiday light display in the state. Fox 46 Chief Meteorologist Tara Lane is live from Speedway Christmas all bundled up by the way. Absolutely Tara that chill in the air really going to help families get into the holiday spirit tonight. And that's right. We are, are feeling more like the season. That's for sure. It is the season here at Speedway Christmas. As you said, opening night tonight, it kicks off in about an hour and a half from now. Six o'clock runs until 10 o'clock every evening that it, it is out here uh, Thursday through Sunday. And we're actually here in the infield right now, if you can tell that. I'm joined now by uh, with Greg Walter. Greg, you are the executive vice president and general manager of the Charlotte Motor Speedway here. Nice to see you again. You as well. Thanks for being out here tonight. All right. So, as I said, we're here in the infield, the Christmas Village, which is back this year. Talk a little about that, because last year kind of took a break from it, but still folks were able to drive around and see the light. Yeah, so last year we couldn't do it because of, of COVID protocols, but we had so many fans reach out to us. So we want our pictures with Santa. We wanted to do the s'more pits and the hot chocolate. So we brought it back. It's a little bit different configuration, but it's such a great time for families. You know, when you go through the lights, the Christmas Village is about halfway. So it's a great break for listen to a little Christmas music, be by the fire pit. Um, nothing feels better for the season than the being here in the village. Oh, that's right. Here in the village, as you said, we've got the s'mores and, and chairs sitting around the different fire pits and things like that. Santa, I, I'm told, is supposed to arrive a little bit later on this evening. Uh, you, you were here, so he wanted to be here. So, yeah, he'll be here a little bit later. Yeah. I can't wait. I've never gotten to interview Santa Claus before. Wow. <laughs> He's a great interview, by the way. <laughs> and, of course, tonight we have movie night as well. And uh, by Fox Charlotte, uh, here we've got the different movies playing each week so folks can come out and park their car or drive around and watch the movie at the same time. Yeah, so it's like a traditional drive-in theater. It's the world's second largest outdoor TV screen, so a great chance to, to watch a Christmas classic, um, be by the fire pits, or just watch the Christmas lights. It's all here. And I know you guys have different themes every year um, for the Speedway Christmas. This year's theme is the 12 days of Christmas. That's right. So talk a little bit about that. It is. So every year we change them out. So the first portion of the circuit has these static displays where we're... Um, we basically have a Christmas theme, Christmas, you know, Santa at the North Pole. This year, the 12 days of Christmas return. I can tell you the staff wishes it was like 14 or 15 days of Christmas, you know, <laughs> with all the lights set up. Um, but it's, it's a, a classic that families always enjoy. And it's almost like two months of Christmas with, uh, you know, almost two months of opportunities that folks yeah. can come out and drive around. It runs all the way through, what is it, January 16th, it I does, believe. Yeah. It does. So I mean, we had so many people say that we ended it too soon, so we tried to accommodate the fans by, by making it go a little bit longer. All right. Thank you, Greg. And we'll see you again in a little bit. Absolutely. Thank you. <laughs> all right, guys. We'll be back here at Fox 46 News at 5 with a very special guest here at Christmas Village. I will see you guys then. Yeah, oh, we can't wait to yeah. see you interview Sam. <laughs> <laughs> Looking forward to that. Thank you, Tara. <laughs> and as she mentioned, it is movie night tonight. It is the Fox Charlotte movie night. You can watch it on what they said, the second largest outdoor TV screen in the world. That's unbelievable. That is going to be one very large Macaulay Culkin. <laughs> as tonight's movie is Home Alone 2, Lost in New York. One of my favorites, Lindsay. It is a good one. It's a classic. And